the kids door to dooring, and all over town, blood sugar was soaring. But the Simpson abode was deep down in the dumps, because from little to bigger, the kids had the mum. Wait a second, it's Halloween? Just rest on the sofa. I'll be home by 10. We have some candy. Just one m M&M. and And we looked and we saw him. The fat in the hat. I'll save Halloween for you three grumpy tots. Now hop on my cycle. There's nothing to fear. And we shall have candy. And maybe some beer. I'll give you the business, you yellow sea cow. Let's go getting old Sterwell. Where am I now? <laughs> I am the Borax. I speak for the woods, but I've plastered my likeness on consumer goods. Hello. Oh, the fat in the hat doesn't care what moms say. The minute they leave you, he'll take you away. Yeah. Yes. Trick or treat! Who buzz the buzzard? Don't pester the rich. I don't hand out candy, you son of a gritch. You laughed as he heard that old codger's house sizzles. Enough with the lessons. This isn't a school. <laughs> I don't got no candy, I only serve beer. Hey, 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 this is supposed to be a children's story. Go grab all his money and vodka and gin, and I'll knit a nice snort from his leathery skin. I know a man with an overpriced store who give all that he can. Take whatever you want, I don't want any trouble. Take gyms that are slim and gum of the bubble. We had to escape from this beheaded mammal. So we hitched us a ride on a three-hump gum mammal. A gum mammal's a camel, but faster and humbler. But when we got home, he was waiting inside! Cause I'm your new daddy, the fat in the... Stop! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Bart, isn't it dangerous to fly your Stupid kite by an airport? I'm alive! All patched up! End of story. Actually, there's a little more. I caramba! But Lisa, your brain is still in complete control. I could do what I want to Bart's head? Uh, Oops. Ah, all good. No! Oh. Everyone's welcome to my man cave. So in conclusion, my show and tell is this. Excellent, Lisa. A plus. Bart, your turn. Bart, I expected more from a fourth grade head. <laughs> You're rotating it in the wrong direction! Why don't you try to say something good about each other? Well, she's pretty healthy for someone who's been living with cooties. Bart, aren't Lisa's ears clean? I think we've made some progress here. Great. Oh, and I have just two heads for one coupon? <laughs> Should have chopped off Bart's head long ago. Oh, not the pony dream again. Hey, I did that. Yep, that's me. Oh, Nixon! <laughs> you start a car as well as you start a family. <laughs> Now I'll just cut off her annoying head, and this body will be all mine. Brother can never be friends with his sister. Are you really, really sure? I'm afraid I am. Well then, I guess I have no choice. Whoa! Ah! How could this go wrong? Well, wherever I am, it's got to be an improvement. Guess again. Oh. Now I can always sing karaoke duets. Step right up. Step right up as Marguerite conquers the air. Disbelieve as the strong man pulls a wagon with his bare tongue. This is a song that you hear at the circus, sung by a guy that you see at the circus. <laughs> the human donkey. Hee-haw! The terrifying callback. 
Mark! Yeah! Ing! Yeah! The most hideous creature of all. How you doing? <laughs> so, uh, anyone here from New Jersey? <laughs> A torso? What's huh? with the cookies? Even a human snail would have been done by now. All of you, get back out there with your flippers flapping and your stomps are stumping. Joe and Jane Normal expect some entertainment for their nickel. Mr. Burnsome, you should treat these poor people with respect. Taste the strength of your fiance. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am, but uh, I ain't never seen a normal stand up for us. <sighs> I, too, am a freak. One eye is blue and the other a pale brown. You should ask her out, Mo. Uh, but she's sweet on a strong man. Uh, you're fine unless rabbity as he is and tells Big Mouth. Well, you've got an emerald ring. My mother's ring. <laughs> she gave it to me on a deathbed. She also acquired it on a deathbed. How do I get my hands on it? I'm an idiot. Of course. I get Marge to marry Mo, then I kill Mo, then she gets the ring, then I marry her, and the ring is mine. Hey, Mark, you want to marry Mo? I'm engaged to you, my love. The poor lonely fellow is about to die. But, you know, you could make his last day a happy one. And the ring is just the icing on the cake. What ring? Yow, indeed. And so, with the conclusion of our traditional wedding song, I now declare you husband and wife. Mo. Whatever small time together we have. To you, Marge. Now you are one of us. One of us. Goo, goo, goo. God, you are so beautiful in that penwad there. I, uh, better freshen up a little bit. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, trying to kill Mo so we'll get his emerald. By the way, I haven't checked, but emeralds are valuable, right? <gasps> Leave my trailer forever. You're rejecting me? But I'm in the best shape anyone is in the 1930s. I said go. What the hell does Google Goo mean? We don't know. Google Goo. We don't know. Google Goo. Make him one of us. One of us. One this of is us. exactly why circus attendance is plummeting. And that, kids, is how I met your mother.